Hello students, welcome to Marvelous Monday. Let's find a place where we have some space so we can enjoy our stretch. I'm gonna take a big breath and blow it all out like a loud balloon. Here we go. When I'm here in downward frog, I can hop a little and feel a wiggle and a stretch in my ankles. I can wobble around and feel a stretch in my knees. I can wiggle some more and feel a stretch in my hips. Now I'm gonna put my hands down, drop my head and stretch my legs. Then roll up. Okay, my feet are shoulder width apart. I'm going to stand straight and tall but not stiff. And I'm going to gently close my eyes so I can enjoy my breathing. Breathing in. Hand out, and in, and out. I can imagine myself a strong, calm mountain. Breathing in, and out. My feet go to the center of the earth. My head is high in the sky as I breathe in, and out. I'm strong and calm. All of life is all around me. The animals are on me. The plants are growing out of me. And I'm strong and calm. Breathing in and out. The wind is blowing across me. The rain may fall. And I stay strong and calm. Breathing in and out. Open your eyes. Okay, so this week I'm so excited. We are going to start to learn more about Native Americans. And something that's very important to Native Americans and to us too, I think, is corn. So our song that we're going to learn today is called Grinding Corn. And the words are really easy. It's the tune that the notes that are a little tricky. So let's go over this for starters. You can see there's a Native American girl with some corn, and there's some corn, and it goes grinding corn, grinding corn. Here we are grinding corn. Grains are red and yellow. Blue and white corn, I am grinding. Right, so you know corn comes in all different colors. I'm not sure you've all seen that before. I might see if I could get some different colored corn to show you. But the tricky part about this is the tune. So I'm going to sing it first so you can hear it and I'm going to have my hand go up and down the way the tune does. So it goes grinding corn, grinding corn, here we are grinding corn. Grains are red and yellow, blue and white corn, I am grinding. Okay, let's try that together. Here we go. Grinding corn, grinding corn, here we are grinding corn. Grains are red and yellow, blue and white corn. I am grinding. And it talks about grinding corn. So you might like corn, just like corn kernels that you eat maybe from a bowl, or you might like corn on the cob, elote, see? right? That's where you get to eat the kernels off the cob. But corn is used for so many other things. When you eat tortillas, right, that is corn that has been dried off the cob and then it's been ground. So the action we do for the song is like a grinder, a molina, right? A mill that's grinding the corn. Okay, let's do it one last time. Grinding corn, grinding corn, here we are grinding corn. Grains are red and yellow, blue and white corn, I am grinding. It's hard to be quiet at the end. Sometimes you want to say corn. <laughs> anyway, give me a minute and we'll go take a look at our Let's message. Let's take a look at our message. November 16th, 2020. Dear students, we have been learning about the harvest. Okay, yeah. One idea, one sentence, we have been learning about the harvest. Corn is an important crop. Okay, remember a crop is food that's grown for us to 
harvest and use to eat. What do you know about corn? Mrs. Kilmer. Okay, corn is an important crop. What do you know about corn? What do you know about corn? You'll have a chance to share in Seesaw today about what you might know about corn or how you use corn or how does corn, sorry, or how do you and your family enjoy corn? And this is a little preview. The read aloud today is going to be corn, a Nade, an American Indian gift. And that's because we are also in social studies going to start making connections and learning more about Native Americans. The Native Americans who were here in Virginia hundreds years of years ago and are still here today. And that's what we're going to be learning over the next uh, couple of weeks. So I look forward to hearing from you in Seesaw about what you know about corn or what you enjoy doing with corn. See you later. Bye.